rain in the area, but we've been given the go-ahead to get this one started. Tonight, an intriguing matchup between the Somerset Patriots and the Flying Squirrels of Richmond. It's baseball. It's the show, and it comes your way next. Striding in is Jason Dominguez, and we are set for baseball here this evening. The 1-1 one, one home. Ball that time. And he popped him up over toward the left side of the infield. And this is taken in for out number one. Ready now is Zach Zayner. The left fielder. Bases Zach. are empty, one man out. Zayner. Two and one. Well, you don't need us to tell you. It's really starting to come down out there. I can't imagine the umpires will let this go too much longer if it doesn't ease up. Yeah. Now, this doesn't look too good. I, I wouldn't be surprised if we don't see the umpires come out and bring the ground crew out here. The infield, around the mound, and around the home plate area is really getting soaking wet. I can't anticipate this going on very much longer. On the line, that's a base hit. That is third. The first base hit. At the plate, Chris Gibbons. Ball, and he lays off for a ball, two and one. Yeah. Breaking ball drops right in the chute for a strike. Outside in a full count, three and two. We could see the runner in motion here on a three-two count with one out. There's a pretty good chance he's going to get a pitch to swing at. And if not, it's ball four anyways. Long run for the center fielder. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Trey Ambergy. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. Hit the target, but this is low, two and one. A little bouncer. Swing and a miss at a big breaking ball, and that's how the inning comes to an end. Now into the box, Mitchell Tolman. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. 1-1. One, one. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to one and two now. Hey, if he's going to execute that curveball, and that's the that's first in. one of the ball day, two. if he's going to execute it like that, be on the lookout for that one. That's going to be a big pitch for him today. On a good curveball, gets him swinging for wrap number one. So here is that Elliot exactly. Ramos. The center fielder. Elliot. Now the 2-1. He's in there for strike number two. Let's get it going, boys. Somebody's loose, hitting 98 with ease in the first inning. Curveball grounded towards second. Throw on to first, two gone. Two down, no one on base. And up next is Alexander Canario. Canario. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. He's falling behind now, three and one. This is a good at bat so far here with two away. If you're going to go down one, two, three, at least make the guy work for it. He's doing that, and he's even gotten himself into a good hitter's count now. Soft liner towards short. And that's in there, so perhaps some life here with two men out. Batting four. The left fielder. Hunter. Stepping in now, Hunter Bishop. Bishop. And this is low, ball two. Two and one. And it's fouled away. 
A runner on first with two away. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Second inning set to go, and stepping up as the shortstop, Anthony Volpe. Here's the 1-1. One -one. Now a swing at a ball popped in the air back behind short. Luciano backs up a bit, and he takes charge for the first out. And now in the box, the Wilkerman base. Garcia, Wilkerman. as he'll dig into the left-handed batter's box. Line towards center field. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. In now, Donnie Sands. That's strike two on a well-placed changeup around the knees. This one's flared toward left center. And that'll get down for a base hit. The throw to third. And he is in there. Into the box now, Michael Beltre. Line drive to center field. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And not in time as the run scores. Now with the plate is Anthony Siegler. The catcher, Anthony Siegler. The 1-1 one, one home. Two balls, one strike. Sent in the air out to straightaway center. Ramos finds some space out there for the catch to retire the side. the designated hitter Vince Fernandez as they'll have five six and seven here to start the home half of the second hit back up the middle and a base hit so the leadoff man is aboard that is good. the first baseman Jason. standing in now Jason Krizan down low, two, two balls, balls and a strike. The count. And he can't oh, catch the corner down. here, so he's behind three and one. No reason to sit on anything other than hard stuff in a location you like and drive it right now. Ground ball sent back up the middle, and that's through for a hit. That's good stuff. Into the box, Marco Luciano. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. A time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. This is in the air out to right field. Right fielder is on the run. He gets there to put it away, but the runner tags and breaks for third. And he'll move up to third now. Runners at the corners here with one away. Third baseman. Digging in will be Jacob Gonzalez trying to bring in the tying run from third here. Ah, and he pulled the string a bit too sharply there on a curveball as it's down around the shoe tops. He's got a couple of pitches to deal with right here, but he's starting to lose command of his pitches. It might be time to take a step back and try to refocus on making some good pitches. Runners are at first and third, one away. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Batting nine. So the stepping catcher. in is Brian oh, Torres. Yeah. The potential tying run for him at third base. One and one. Here it is. Here's a little chopper up the middle. And the off-balance throw gets him as he takes away a hit, and the side is retired. Back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Jason Dominguez. 0 for 1 here in the early going. And he lays off there, ball four. So the leadoff man is on here to begin inning number three. 
now batting. At the plate the now team. is Zach Zayner. He singled in his first A.B. The 1-1 home takes a pitch for strike number two. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's locating, feeling really good about his fastball. Two back-to-back. Swing and a miss there as the breaking ball takes care of him for the first out. Stepping up is Chris Gittins. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. One and two now as that's in there at the knees. Hey, that's a quality take right there. He knows the pitcher's trying to get him to hit a ground ball and roll two. Misses, ball two. Two two on its tailor made to short six four three it's a double play and the inning is over. Bottom of the third now and that'll bring in the second baseman Mitchell Tolman. The one one home. Hey. Called strike on the edge of the strike zone. I love everything this pitcher's got working right now. He's got presence. He's got great body language on the mound. He's got fastball command and a nice early feel for his off-speed stuff. That's so two ball. balls and two strikes now. We just saw a fastball right there. I would not be shocked if he tries to get this guy to go fishing right here and drops a little off-speed pitch in the dirt. Full count now. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. This is in the air out to left field. Zayner comes in a few steps as he hauls it in for the first down. One out, base is empty. And the next up is Elliot Ramos. There's a fastball well off the plate for a ball. Two and one. And this is lined hard to deep left. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. And this will get all the way to the wall now. And he is in at second base with a one out double. Now that the right field. Alex To the plate now, Alexander Canario. Hit the target, but this is low, two and one. him up and he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out so stepping in is Hunter Bishop trying now here to plate the Let's tying move. run from second runner in scoring position Bishop. at second with two down on the run this one in one on him and he can't right. connect yeah. so he finds himself down one and two now Really tied him up on that one. Yikes, he kind of looked clueless on that swing right there, Matt. If I'm pitching, I'm going right back to that same pitch. Fouled off. Ready with the one, two. Ball now a inside. curveball misses inside. Curveball that time, but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going. A bouncer up the middle. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. New inning set to get underway, and next it'll be the outfielder, Trey Ambergy. Back up the middle. That's through for a base hit, and he's one for two now. So the fourth inning opens with a leadoff single. Now batting, shortstop, Anthony Volpe. At the plate, Anthony Volpe. Hey. You can't do much with that one. It's one and two. Looked like the curveball slipped out that time. 
That hook stayed up in the zone. You can see he struggled with that curveball early. He's trying to find that release point with his off-speed pitches. Love to see if he can find the feel for that thing moving forward. Swing, and he takes this the other way to right. Canario is there, one away. Now to bat, Wilkerman Garcia. He singled first time up. Ambergy, a runner at first with one gone in the inning. And this is low, ball two. Two and one. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Center fielder on the run. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Stepping in once again is Donnie Sands. One for one with a single so far. Here comes the one two. Swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Leading off the inning it'll be Vince Fernandez. They'll look to spark the offense and even things up. Now the pitch. Nope. Sitting in a good spot right here. Two, two, two ball, ball one strike count is yet to see a fastball. Have to be sitting on one right here. Boy he just two, threw two, that two. fastball by him. Purple got him swinging for the first out. Stepping in next the Jason bat. Krizan. The he collected base a base hit his first time yes, up. Sir. Now the 2-1 yes, pitch. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Hits are now even at four apiece. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder on the run. But he's not going to get this one. It's into the gap. And he's in there at third with a one-out triple. Now that is the shortstop. Marco. Stepping in now, Marco Luciano. Hey. Off-speed pitch, and there is strike three called. And boy, that zone just got a bit larger. Two away. The third baseman. John Collins. This one is fouled away up to the concourse area. Two outs here with the runner at third. in the air down the right field line. Right fielder is on the run, but it's over his head, and it hops the wall for a ground rule double. In now, Brian Torres hit in the air down the right field line. Long run for the right fielder. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Ready to go in the top of the fifth. And standing in is the DH, Michael Beltre. Now the three and two pitch. Lifted down the line and left. Left fielder giving chase. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. So now next to bat will be it. Anthony Siegler. Anthony. Flew out in his Siegler. only at bat so far. Now the one and one pitch. That ball two. That's a three and one. The call didn't go his way on two and one, but it's important here on three and one to still make a quality pitch. You have to have that the mindset down. that you're still the one in the driver's seat. Now the payoff pitch home. High and deep down the left field line. And that is off the wall, but in foul territory. Foul ball. Fastball. Strike three called as he couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Now batter. Now to the plate, the Jason teams. Dominguez. It was a walk in his Dominguez. last trip. The 1-1 one, one home. Oh, two out, nobody on. Still one and two as he fouls it away.
and he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now, three and two. Zach Zayner would be next. Here's a pop-up now. Luciano is under it, and he's got it for the final out of the frame. Your Brian Keller, a right-handed reliever, now, standing 6-3, gets the Number ball now out of the bullpen. Brian. And stepping in, Mitchell Tolman. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ballgame. One one line hard deep into left. Zayner is there and he makes the catch for the out. That'll bring up Elliot Ramos. One for two with a double on the ledger so far. And he takes ball two and it's two and one. Inside for a ball as he falls behind to him here, three and one. Alexander Canario will be next. There's ball four. That brings up Alexander Canario. He's one for two in the ball game. Here it comes on one and one. Breaking pitch, and this bounces in front of the catcher. Swung on and missed that strike two. two strike. The two two. Three, three and two and now. You've got to execute a good pitch right here. Runner at first is probably going to be on the move, and you've got one three of the three. better hitters on their team up at the plate. And a dive, but he's back in there. Three two pitch. Hit back up the middle. He gets dirty, but he can't make the play. It's a base hit. Throw won't get him. At the plate now, Hunter Bishop. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Now about a 58-foot breaking pitch that he wisely lays off here. Line toward the gap in left center. And that is down for extra bases as this will get one home and maybe two. And the runner from third crosses the plate. And he'll pull into second with one away. The batter, the designated hitter. Into the box, Vince Fernandez. Canario on third. Bishop second with one away. Line drive to center field. And that's in there. Base hit. One run scores. The throw to the plate. And they're not going to get him as he's in there to score. Yulindris Gomez enters to make an appearance on the mound as he inherits a runner at first with one out in the inning. To the plate now, Jason Krizan. And that's taken for a cold strike two. Two strike. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. One there on the first. And talk about doing the job out of the bullpen. One batter, two outs, and the inning is over. Junior Marte takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. All set for the start of the inning, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Zach Zayner. Offense needs to get going right here. You want to try and tighten up this game a little bit before it starts to get into that territory where you're going to start seeing the back end of each bullpen. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. I got three and one. Three balls, one strike. Hit down the line at first. 
throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Next, it'll be Chris Gittens. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. The 1-1 home. This is on the ground over to first. Fielded cleanly in time to first, and there are two away. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Trey Ambergie, who was a strikeout victim his first trip and then collected a base hit his last time around. A ball and two strikes to count now with the bases empty and two away. This offense has been underachieving all day, putting way too much pressure on their own pitching staff. Someone has to have a quality A-B and get this line going. Fouled away. Another 2-2 offering. And this will miss down low in the dirt, so he's worked it full now at 3-2. Rounded back up the middle, reined in. Throw the first with time to spare, and the side is retired. Bottom of the sixth inning now, and coming forward now is the shortstop, Marco Luciano. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. But a foul ball, one and two now. Popped him up. Siegler is in his tracks now. One down. Up next, Jacob Gonzalez. One for two with a double on his line thus far. The one one home. Now a swing, and he gets him to pop it up. Garcia is calling for it, and he makes the catch for the second out. And now Brian Torres. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. From the windup, the 1-1 pitch. A swing, and he pulls it down the line and deep. But that'll be off the right field wall. Around second now and headed for third. And he is in to third with a two-out triple. Now back, second baseman. Mitchell. Into the box now, Mitchell Tolman. Below One the zone, a strike, swing yeah. and a miss. Oh, and they pull the string on a good change up there as he swings and misses, and he's set down on strikes for the second time tonight. Daniel Alvarez is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 68. Now at the plate, Anthony Volpe. He has flied and lined out in two trips in this one. The 2 1. Hit on the ground to third. Right to him. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. Now that. Next Second up, Wilkerman Garcia, Wilkerman. one for two on his line Garcia. so far in the game. Now the 2-1. Nope. That's inside. Donnie Sands waits on deck. The 3-1. Takes Eight. a strike for two. a full count now, three and two. Full count. Three and two. Drilled right back up the middle, and that finds its way into center for a one-out base hit. Now that third baseman, Sands. At the plate, Donnie Sands, and this is on the ground to short. Could be two. There's one on the first. It's a double play as their woes continue. The inning is over. Last half of the seventh here, and digging in is the outfielder, Elliot Ramos. The 1-1. One, one. Ball. Two balls, one strike. That's ball three.
swung on and fouled as it looked to make it all the way up into the concourse area. And that misses ball four. It's a leadoff walk to start the home seventh. Next up is Alexander Canario. He's two for three and looking for more here. The 1 1 pitch. High and deep down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. In the dirt here. And he is in there. They couldn't get him at second. And he'll make it in easily at second, as I'd imagine that'll be scored a pass ball. A 1 1. Swing and a liner. And this is going to be a fair ball as it'll head to the corner. To second now, but he's safe. As also on the play, a run comes across to score. Number eight. Designated hitter. Stepping in now, Vince Fernandez in the air down the line in left. Zayner is right there as he'll put it away without much problem for the second out. So now into the box now is Maddie. Jason Krizan. So far, two Jason. for three in this one. Krizan. Swing and a miss. Blew the fastball right by him, and the inning is over. Ready to begin the eighth and striding forward the designated hitter, Michael Beltre. And he fouls this one off. Line drive snagged on a short hop. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Next to stand in is Anthony Siegler. He flew out his first time around and then was a strikeout victim most recently. Breaking ball called just a bit low. I got two one the count. Swing and he pops him up. And this will not be caught. It's a foul ball. Here now the 2-2. And he goes and chops this one out towards second. And he'll whip this one over to first, and he gets his man for the second out. Now at the plate, here is Jason Dominguez. He got under one and popped out his last time up. The 1-1 one -one home is taken for nope. ball two. 5-1 our score as we play the eighth. And here's a slider that runs inside that time, and that'll keep him from diving out over the plate. That's a good pitch right there, but you know, as a base stealer, when you're in the box like that, you want to protect your money makers, right? You don't want anything around your knees or your feet, so he was fortunate to get out of the way of that one. Zach Zayner. The 1-1 home. Hit well down the left field line, but back into the crowd foul. He got the fastball where he wanted and just pulled off of it. Now a fastball swung on and missed, and that is out number three. Addison Russ is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 75, Addison so now here is Marco Luciano. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Here's the one and two. Uh, got him swinging on the split finger pitch, and that's out number one. Now to the plate, here is Jacob Gonzalez. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. He's set. Here comes the one one. I got to count one and two. Nobody on. Inside, Way inside with that one. A pretty easy take there. Wow, kind of an interesting pitch call there. 
The batter flailed at the pitch away on the previous one, so you'd think you'd go right back there, but instead they decided to come in. Make him prove he can adjust before you do. So he got him swinging. Oh, yeah. Jacob Gonzalez goes down for out number two in the bottom half. And he lays off the pitch down and away. Ball two. Lifted down the line and left. Left fielder is on the move. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Ryan Halstead comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. Number 40. All set to start the ninth in this one. And here comes the first baseman, Chris Gittens. And he'll just fight this one off as it's chopped foul. Here comes the one two. I got to count two and two. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. Now Next to hit, right Trey Ambergy. Trey Ambergy. The 3 2 pitch. Keeps fighting him off. The eighth pitch of the at bat coming up. And he finally wins the battle as this is swung on and missed for the second out. The Next, here the is shot. Anthony Volpe. Anthony. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. Nope, Just a ball. bit low. A tough call, but it's two and two. Great take right there, but the last thing you want to do is be called out on strikes to end the game. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. This is line to left. And call that a nice clean base hit, his first of the game. So the two out base hit, and the top of the inning is still alive. The back, the second base, Wilkerman Garcia. Standing in now, Wilkerman Garcia. And this ball swung on and hit to center field, and this should do it. Ramos is there to make the catch, and with that, the ball game is over. It's always nice to give your fans at home something to cheer about, and they definitely did that right here, coming through with a big win at home. Tonight's game comes to an end, 5-1 to one, the final score. Richmond used a nice fifth inning to take the lead, and they never gave it back. Sean Jelly takes home the win. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRozan, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, over to theshow.com.